That's the end of the drama. And in that end, deep calls to deep. And the two become one. And the I that is awake is one with the dream. But then the dreamer awakes. Then we understand the word in the 44th Psalm. Rouse thyself. Why sleepest thou, O Lord? Do not cast us off forever. Awake. For then the Lord awakes, the dreamer awakes, and the dreamer in you is God. By then the two become one. And so in my vision of Sunday morning, self in self and risen is the end of the play. When these two are drawn together and they are one. Now you think of God. Can't help it. You're thinking of it. Or they're not yet drawn together. And so the world addresses God as thou. The aim when they're drawn together, you can't address the unity as thou. It's I am. Until the two become one, you always think of God. You think of Jesus Christ. You think of the Lord. Many times the name God, Jehovah, Jesus Christ, Lord, in any way whatsoever, conveys the sense of an existence, someone outside of self, that is a false God. <clears throat> but you can't blame man for that, for the drama is not over in the life of the individual who still sees God as another. When the drama comes to its end, there is no other. The two are one. And then you rise. You rise in the world of eternity. This is all revelation. It's not anything you can sit down and rationalize. Revealed truth cannot be logically proved. You can't do it. And if man insists on tearing it apart by his reason, for that he insists, he will do it forever and never find it. He will come in his own good time, after you've gone through the furnaces, and no one will escape the furnaces. You cannot bring him out of the world of death, unless he goes through these furnaces of affliction. And then he comes out, and when he comes out, he is the hero, he is the victor. He went into a battle with death, and then overcame. And then he returns to being that he was before that the world was. He gave up all that is his to enter this world of death. He isn't pretending that he's man. <clears throat> he actually became man, that man may become God. <laughs>